the Red Shadow Ninja. So I've already shown this guy in the Red Shadows Oni figure video, but this is the actual Red Shadows Ninja. And I got the file card for him yesterday, I think. Th yesterday, today, I want to see, I think it might have been today. Uh, so, another cracking custom card. Great looking artwork. And we have the file card info, the bio info. Okay, Black Major Ninja, code name Red Shadow. Primary specialty intelligence, secondary specialty covert ops, birthplace non applicable. This is a troop builder. Unlike the Cobra Red Ninja, the Red Shadow are motivated by honor and duty. They follow the rule of the Black Major. His word is law, and they consider it a privilege to fall in battle following his commands. Red Shadows are equally loyal and ruthless. As masters of almost every bladed weapon, it is a good chance they will, kill, they will defeat any opponent one-on-one. -on -one. If you happen to encounter them in groups, defeat is certain. So, these guys die in battle. They consider it to be an honor. They take the corpse and pass it through a demon gate and have it reanimated. So, that's a, that's a really cool theme to me. It brings a, a lot of mysticism and whatnot into the, uh, into the stories for these. And these file cards... Uh, they help to create what's really its own um, third-party G.I. Joe related, not like G.I. Joe offshoot uh, universe in itself. You know, I could see comic books being made just on uh, just on some of these these characters. Um, you know, maybe maybe we can someday have like a third-party uh, comic book come out that's using these characters that are, uh, you know, they're similar to the G.I. Joe mythos. They're similar to the, the stories and whatnot for G.I. Joe. But, um, you know, like, I, I think the idea of a third-party comic would be pretty cool. Um, I know that a lot of work goes into creating these cards and writing the uh, the bios and whatnot. But, you know, the bios are, they're creative. It's somebody expanding on what we don't have anymore. You know, we do have comics for G.I. Joe, but we don't have new figures coming out. We certainly don't and probably will never have new O-Ring figures coming out unless we end up with something like, um, if Hasbro does something with G.I. Joe, like what they're doing with uh, Star Wars and um, and Transformers, doing like a reissue of uh, like the original O-Ring figures, which I think would be fantastic if they would re-release all of those, like the original 13 figures carded um, I, I think that would be fantastic for everybody. I know I'd buy a shitload of them, but, um, uh, you know, we don't have anything new coming out from Hasbro, so it's all in the hands of third party for what we want now, unless we're going to buy vintage and the prices on vintage are really up there. Uh, this is just a spare head that I had that came with the Oni figure. The Oni figure already had the head switched out by someone whenever I got it, but yeah, and, and that's another cool feature to some of these figures is the fact that you know, you're creating an entirely new character by just swapping out a head. So, he is molded in the red plastic with the flesh tone paint apps, black silver paint apps, and the red shadows sigil on his chest in silver and black which i thought that was pretty cool most of these are a single color tampo but that one is a two color and i'm not sure if that's a if paint water slide or what but he also comes with the standard ninja weapons pack has the nunchucks the bow the backpack quiver and the two swords so more videos coming up guys like i said trying to knock out several of these this weekend and uh you know, I'll have uh, I'll have them put together and uploaded. Probably start working on that tonight, and then I'll be sharing. Uh, I, I'm trying to think of things to uh, help spread some of these videos. I may put links to uh, a few different things in uh, in the descriptions um, 
Facebook groups or, you know, different places where I, I order figures, you know, eBay or whatever. I, I, I don't know. Something different. Um, I need to do a, a giveaway again here soon. I'll probably run that on Facebook. Um, I haven't had much luck with, like, selling anything on Instagram. I don't know what a, uh, a giveaway or, like, a raffle would do on Instagram, but I might give that a shot and see what happens. So, all right. Thanks for watching, guys. Later.